this is a statement put out by one of your favorite uh, stage actors. His name is Andrew Tando Adote. Andrew Tando Adote. He's a theater stage actor uh, with Roverman Productions. Uh, that maybe he has been featured. He has been featured in other productions as well. He posted something that I wish we can make sense out of, because according to him, he's saying that please share if I'm making sense. <laughs> <laughs> One thing we should know is this, if Kepakla actors don't that good mm -hmm. and they have some great actors mm -hmm. surrounding them, mm -hmm. some of those actors could even help mm -hmm. or groom them in a way mm -hmm. whereby you bring out the best mm -hmm. in them, mm -hmm. you which is on that set. So, mm -hmm. um, so the little stuff I've seen from, as in the trailer, mm -hmm. I've seen from, from, um, the Yahweh bus, mm -hmm. mostly the, the the area of Ejako and things. Mm -hmm. I think the role is being given. Mm -hmm. he's, he's a good, but they didn't give him the space to play his normal thing. You think thing. Ajako was not given the space? To play his normal thing, okay. but well directed, mm -hmm. you know, on that particular scene, the mm -hmm. little aspect of the scene. Mm -hmm. And if I could see that only the part, mm -hmm. I think we could see more too mm -hmm. on, 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 on the day of the premiere. Mm -hmm. The only person too I want to see is Moisha Boudon, <laughs> which, you know, um, other... Why? Do you doubt her acting prowess? For me, I've never seen what he, she has she really done. She has really done, mm -hmm. and I, I don't In really acting. see, I, I only see her as a slave queen, you know. What, so, what, what do you mean by you only see her as a slave queen? No, she only slay. She only slay on I and... Let's, what, what, t -t -t so I'm slave, slave. What is slave? She has a high person. She, 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 she has her own way of fashion, which she takes, she, she portrays to the public, like, and on a stage. That's what makes it slave. Uh, that's, the, that's the title they've given it to. Yeah, that is the title he's been given. So, for real, listen. Only point, only point, only point. Yeah, for I mean, real, real, I have my floor. I have my floor. See, as a panel. You see, there are some things I wouldn't want to encourage on so platforms that I have power. <laughs> Everyone has how they want to live their life. Exactly. So, if someone wants to be a fashionista, and because of that, you think. Uh, you you are not going to see oh, any sure. good in her apart from being a slave queen. Then I'm sorry, uh, that, that that is not that is not a good description of her. I'm sorry. She is an actress. Uh, she has her own life, like you said. She's a socialite, and that doesn't mean she's a different person from any of the people. Yeah, there. Uh, the fact that you've, you've also not seen her in so many movies that's doing much doesn't mean she's not a good actress. Wait, else, wait till you experience her well. Else, you say that. Wait. Till you experience her well, I beg you, I beg you, I take your time. Pa. If it's someone else, you will say that. Sorry, Mafio. Mr. Mafio, Kofi. Mafio, Mafio, Pa. Sorry, Mr. Mafio, Shabi. Kakaba, I'm going to talk to you. Kakaba, I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to talk to you for saying, I'm still a panel. And this one, I'm here as a member of the panel. But I didn't want to see you as such. Until we start, I'm going to talk to you, Mr. Mafio. I'm going to talk to you, Mr. Mafio. I'm going to talk to you. If you listen to what I'm about to read, okay. um, the person actually said, please share if I'm making any sense. If he is and I'm reading this from Andrew Tando Adote. Andrew Tando Adote. He wrote, huge thanks to everyone who came to join us, Roverman Productions, for Dora Hwai play, that the name of the play is Dora Hwai uh, play, this past weekend. I have been hearing a lot of great comments about my performance for which I'm grateful. One I hear a lot is this guy should be in Hollywood. This guy should be in Hollywood. Not the Wednesday one on radio, but the Hollywood proper where for real went to. He says, trust me, that's very flattering to hear. But I've been thinking about that statement a lot and would like to share what is on my mind. I think we will make sure Hollywood notices you. That is how, or let me say it again. I think we will make sure Hollywood notices you sounds a lot more encouraging than you should be in Hollywood. Let me explain. I think an actor's rise, especially nowadays, depends largely on the numbers behind him or her. Talent also helps a great deal, but this business runs on numbers. The reason why a few more famous actors are more sought after than the unknown others is because they have more numbers. 
more people know who John Dumelo is than who Andrew Tando Adote is. More numbers, more bats in seats, and more money. Are you a fan of any GH actor, theater group, or film studio but don't follow them on social media? Do you enjoy productions but don't tag or hashtag or retweet or mention how much fun you had at your show on your WhatsApp status or social media platforms? If you want to see your favorite actor, theater group or uh, film studio go international take a minute out of your day to give them a follow make the poster your dp for a couple of days make noise about them in your own corner of the internet don't leave it all to the news outlets and celebrity bloggers don't think we don't need you to give us a mention or review if you feel we blessed and uh, inspired you then give us a like or follow at least when it shows support in your numbers, you are telling the world you guys don't know what you are missing and the world will pay attention. You think I should be in Hollywood? Okay, let's work together. I will dedicate my life to give you great performances. Uh, you in your own small ways. Make whoever out there that hasn't heard of your favorite actor, theater group or film studio feel so jealous that they will go looking for them. Let's give that a try. Please share if that makes sense to you. Thanks and God bless you. <coughs> Dora Y runs again on Easter weekend. See you there. This was shared or posted by Andrew Tando Adote of Roverman Productions. I want to believe, Kofi, you know him. Uh, I don't know him, but uh, I don't know him. Uh, I've never heard about him. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't see the play mm -hmm. as well. But Sammy, he couldn't have said it any better. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I've always said that numbers. Uh, and endorse. Oh, I know him. Okay, by face, I know him. Okay, good. He's mm -hmm. a very good actor. Mm -hmm. I think numbers, and I will say numbers are an endorsement of presence mm -hmm. and to a large extent relevance. Mm -hmm. It may not be an endorsement of performance, but it's something. your vocal energy that your mic should come up on you are far from it. Yeah, the year you buy in Jane. I I've always said that mm -hmm. numbers. Mm -hmm an endorsement of presence mm -hmm. and to a large extent relevance mm -hmm. it may not be an endorsement of performance or talent mm -hmm. but once you have the numbers it seeks to suggest that you do exist and people appreciate the fact that you exist and you have some level of relevance within mm -hmm. the circles you operate mm -hmm. and so i mean oh ayana area in this country we seem to quickly come against people who begin to get rising following Hey, where are they now? One million views. Where are you then? You're on your star. Where are they? I mean, I don't see him as actor. You see, it's like, come and when somebody is right. We can't all rise for the same reason. It is not possible. We will be rising because of your actors. We will be rising because of your social, or your, or your Instagram sensation. We will be rising because of your producer. We will be rising because of your makeup artist. We will be honest how they would rise. Mm -hmm. But then again, like he said, it is, it's very important. Numbers. It is the numbers that will give you the notice that you want. It is the numbers that will push you to the Hollywood that you want to go. It is not just performance. It is the numbers. It is the following. It is, that is how corporate organizers, that is how even agents, distributors, that is what when distributed before they accept your phone, they will go to box office and look at opening night. Did you get the numbers? So that they will be convinced that if I pick up this film, I am sure that I would get numbers. But we live in a country where even when you have numbers in the cinema, then it means that your film is no good. We live in a country where we can say that this film there is we are, we are looking for money. It's not artistic. This film there, which filmmaker will make a film and say, I don't want to make money? Do you think you'd even find an investor to give you money when you make a film and say that I'm making this one, I don't want to make money? Sammy, numbers are key. It is a when you go to Nigeria, the reason the Nigerian market is flourishing, the reason they are getting funding, is because they have numbers. The reason Netflix would buy uh, uh, her film, uh, uh, Genevieve, 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 because they know that once Genevieve has that huge following, she represents a certain fraction of the African population. And so once they have her there, they are sure that they've covered a bit of Africa. Numbers are key. But our country, Ghana here, and as we were speaking, I heard somebody say that you know somebody was cast because it will give you hype. Sorry? I said that. Yeah, uh -huh. Sorry? I am not paying People make us feel that we don't know what we are doing. No, no, no. What I mean no, is no, no, it's no, not I a mean, negative thing. No. I just know. Let me finish. Uh -huh. Sorry, you see, people don't understand film in depth. Casting. That is why when you go to Hollywood, 
For how many years was Arnold Schwarzenegger used to play the same kind of role? For how many years? Did we ever get fed up? No. For how many years did Steven Seagal keep breaking neck? That's the only way he won all his fight. It was always, almost always the same thing. Everywhere in the world, every jurisdiction, the star system, Hollywood near the buy. And then near the buy. Why did they adopt the star system? Numbers. Numbers. Look at Black Panther. Numbers. Look at the portfolio of the cast used in Black Panther. The Black Panther that we all praise about. They had a mix of musicians. People with numbers. They didn't bring newbies to play lead. Numbers. But in our country, when you use that, it's like it's as if in this country, when you raise people, man, when you raise new talent, people say, Oh, you are using stars, uh, use new faces, give us opportunities. I mean, so are you telling us that you will raise stars from scratch, bring them when they become stars, you drop them and use new faces? It doesn't make sense anywhere in the world. That is why today, when we are looking for people to play old men, we will make Lauren up to play old man. Because you've neglected the older people. That is why for seven years, Sejako is home, not being in any film whatsoever. Mm -hmm. Because when you start using, and I get this a lot, why are you always using cannabis? Why are you always using it? So you pick them up and you drop them up. And this is what they do for a living. You see, today somebody is here saying that, Moisa, you don't see her as an actress. Mm -hmm. And so if we don't give her the opportunity to be on TV, how then will she live? Have they been made me land on my point? It would have been good. So, I mean, do you know what I'm she saying? All these people, stand. John Dumelo, Ivan Nelson, all these people, they are superstars. They are stars. Are you saying that now that they are their peak, we should drop them and not work with them? So, I mean, how would they make a living? These new faces that today everybody is preaching, let's use new faces. I mean, let's do a, an all new face film and see the numbers that will work into the cinema. Sometimes you are just being hypocritical about a lot of things. When Hollywood does it, nobody talks. Look at the Indians. They have a consistent star system. Mechanics that works over there. Every film, there are certain people that you always see. And in most cases, they even play almost the same character. In different films, almost the same character. I don't think I've seen any film where Arnold Schwarzenegger was a pastor. Or Arnold Schwarzenegger became the antagonist of any film. Never. He's Nigga, always. Or a blue man. Or a blue man. Did we ever complain? No. Did Steven Seagal ever become an antagonist? No. Yes. Do you understand? Yes. And so, Sami. Uh, let's try, try. Mr. Matip said, Oh, say, baby, not a killer. Yes. I say, movie, yeah. be not a killer. Yeah. Not yes. a blue man. And then that will be news. Ten years. That will be news. Do you know why it will be news? Because it, it's. So now your point has been shut down by. No, it hasn't been shut down. No, they have. No, it hasn't been shut down. Sammy. They have. Oh, yeah, Kelamu, you will never die in a film. Never, not even once. Never. Open that film. Open that film. Let's watch that film. You will never die in a film. Not a Kelamu, oh, yeah. I'm not from Komado, oh, yeah. Terminator 1. Sammy. Film again. Terminator 1, oh, yeah. Terminator 2, oh, yeah. He will never die in the film, okay. and we're okay with it. Mm. But you know, Sami, we like El mm, 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 mm. I was telling somebody that you know, this film, Awebas, the example I hear, mm. people are just coming to see the with pen and paper. Yes. I, I like it. <laughs> Do you know why? No. Sami, I don't know man. Give me two million more films. Okay. Do you understand? I need me two million more films because Sami. Okay. Sometimes when you listen No, to wait, I uh, don't go into yeah. that way back here. No, 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 You are going into it. We are going to have a special time. Now, <laughs> let, 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 let's concentrate. Let's yeah, concentrate. Yeah, no, uh, I want to do a follow-up. Wait, wait, <laughs> Kofi. I want to do a follow-up. He said that people should spend their time out of their busy schedules to follow them and all that. But I'm also asking, um, if you are not doing enough, would I be tempted or would I be encouraged to follow you? There are some people We've actually subscribed to their channels that anytime they post something, Anything. it should an alert should be given to us. So we go and check what they have Post. posted. But then others are also there. Yes, they have the name, they have a profession, they have the brand, but not much is happening there. Do you know why people like um um, um Akiapin Polo and others who always have numbers on social media? They have an activity. Yes. Whether you describe them as uh, in quote, stupid or whatever, they still have an activity going. That engages you. Exactly. And I mean, that's what he said. You see, when you read his post, he says, <laughs> mm -hmm. if you like what I do, yes. there are two different things. It is not by default. Okay, so, so for this time, get, yes. get um, So, for an example, uh, so I mean, for an example, uh -huh. what Agri is saying is that Andrew, the people, Andrew. Andrew is saying that the people who say Hollywood should yeah. notice him, the people who say you should be in Hollywood, don't just say it. 
Show me. Show me support. Share my work. Like me on social media. Follow me on social That is what he's saying. Mm -hmm. If you don't like him, it is fair enough. But, 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 but one thing is also clear. That on social media, what he does on the stage might not be enough to give him extensive numbers on social media because what he does on the stage remains on the stage but the when people who social come media, to watch, he should do extra when the pc Sammy, the people who come to watch on on on, uh, on, on the, the stage uh -huh. who watch the show the stage show uh -huh. they are the people he's asking don't just leave the auditorium and that's over talk once you leave talk about what you saw mm -hmm. and that's like a review mm -hmm. talk about what you saw when you leave the 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 the, 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 the cinema the, the, the or cinema theater, or when you leave the, the theater, theater. Uh -huh. follow me on Instagram. Let people know that my performance at the show was great. So that the next time I have a show, other people who may have seen what you posted would also come. And that is what he said. Yes, I mean, that is what we should do. All right, so we have him. Uh, God being so good, we have um, Andrew Tando Adote. Uh, he is a theater stage actor with a robot production to throw more light on this. Now, Andrew, good morning if you can hear us. Good morning, boss. Mm, how are you doing today, officer? <laughs> Thank you so much. Now, um, we've read one beautiful post you did on social media, and uh, we are interested in the first statement that says, Please share if I'm making any sense. Thanks. To us, you are making enough sense. That is why this morning we are also sharing on radio. But then we have some one or two questions. For instance, in your post, you said that um, the good works that you are doing on, on the stage, that everyone thinks, oh, Andrew should go to Hollywood. They should rather be telling that message on social media, on their WhatsApp statuses and all that. But we are also asking that, yes, you do all the best of jobs on, on the stage. After the stage and on social media where you want to, where you want us to follow you and say much about you, are you also doing much there? I think that this will be our first question. I wasn't speaking just for myself because I'm sure there are other talented uh, performers and actors out there who probably hear the same thing. And I believe that it's, it's going to take both a lot of hard work and consistency on the part of the performer, as well as um, support, tangible support on the side of the audience to, to enable us to achieve what we want to achieve. Now, if you go to my page, I, I do my best to put content out there that relates to the work I do, so that you know exactly what's going on with me, what is uh, what I'm working on, the, the projects and stuff that, that uh, Roverman Productions, as well as myself as an actor, I'm working on so that that and I'm always developing trying to develop more things with voiceovers and things like that so it's not like I'm not doing anything on my page or Roman is not doing anything on their page we are we are updating you on what we're doing what we're up to and things like that so it's not like you'll go to our page and there'll be nothing going on there mm. but then you would also agree with me that there are also people in your profession or in your industry who also have the numbers on social media. But then they did not get only the numbers from their activities, maybe on the stage or in their film production. They got it from their extra activities they do away from sets or from location. Yes, yes. I would agree to that, yes. Mm. And are we adding that so it wouldn't come across we are forcing the people or we are putting them and that jurors to follow us? No, you see, um, that wasn't the that wasn't the aim. You see, because we get a lot of comments from Ghanaians who are really excited about what we are doing, and like I said on in on the post, they they say, Kale, you guys, you are too good to just be here. You have to be out there. You have to be out there." And those are the people I was talking about. You know, if, if you're that excited about what we're doing, then let it be, uh, let, let it show in you following us, you supporting us in your own small way, in your corner of the internet. So it's not like I'm telling everybody that they are mandated to support us because we're Ghanaians. I'm the most people who are really excited, who scream, you know, and, 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 and are so are blown away to the point that they get their friends to come. Those who have been following us for the past 11 years and things like that. Mm. Who I was talking to. Okay, so I just checked your Instagram page. Uh, I want to be sure. Andrew underscore Tando underscore Adote, right? 
Yes. And um, your following is uh, 1,674. I just followed you as well. Um, I, are, you not, are you not encouraged with these numbers? You, you think you should get more? Well, more is always better, isn't it? <laughs> Obviously. Uh, uh, if, 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 the more for, if, the, if the followership increases, it, it opens more doors in other areas, doesn't it? I mean, mm -hmm. it gives the option to, if, if you know, I, I follow a lot of these influencers on social media as well, so as well as these actors, you know, being their page and things like that. So definitely, numbers is like the, the man said in the studio, my boss said in the studio, numbers is, is key. You know, so if I have anything going on, any any project coming up, more people will be made aware of it because they follow the page and there's a, there's that opportunity to interact with people because they can leave comments on the page and things like that, as you can see under some of the posts. Mm. Now let's look at talent and numbers. Uh, when it comes to acting, Andrew Tando Adote, your acting is not questionable. Whoever sees you on stage knows that yeah, this guy uh, was born for it. He is a talented person. There are others who also have numbers on social media, but then when it comes to real talent, you see that they lack. How are we going to just oppose this? Yes, those who have the numbers, uh, but they don't have the talent, but then those who have talent, but they don't have the numbers, can't they use their talent to beat those with numbers? Well, I think it's uh, <laughs> it's it's a very it's a very it's a game of balance that you have to play. If you, if you have the talent and you have the numbers, of course, it's it's great. But um, not everybody. I wouldn't say there are peop the, the people who have the numbers don't necessarily have the talent. Perhaps they do, not to the same degree uh, uh, that as others. But they also have talent. They also have something to offer. That's why people follow them. That's why people find them interesting enough to 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 give them their attention so it's it's it has to be a balance of the two but i wouldn't i wouldn't say i wouldn't agree that the those who have the numbers don't have the talent they have something they have something special about them whether they have the discipline and the consistency to sustain it is another question altogether but i believe anyone who has the attention of the majority of the public has something special about them that is potential Okay, um, let's talk about the career part of Andrew uh, Adote. Uh, for you, for instance, do you do only productions for Roverman or you do for other production houses as well? Oh, I've, I've done work outside Roverman, especially on screen. Uh, uh, if you remember the Beast of No Nation movie, I, I played a small role in there. Okay. Um, some um, TV series and things like that. The latest, which is Yellow Pepper. So um, I do work for agents. I mean, I'm not restricted to Roverman per se. It's just that when we have a production going on, um, I'll have to be a bit more circumspect with how I spend the time. And I make the producers aware that we're in the middle of production, so I'm available on this day or on that day or on that day. Mm. But aside from that, uh, yeah, I, I do work for other production houses. Mm. Now, do you have an idea of the generational difference between your fan base and uh, those who follow you? Because I know very well that the youthful people are those who are very active on social media. They are the ones who make uh, all the noise for you. So if, for instance, Andrew Tando Adote has that fan base who are at the top, uh, maybe middle age or something, can this also be a factor why you might not or some people in your bracket might not be getting the social media bars that they need? Well, no, I, I don't think so because I, we do perform, we look at the audience and we see quite a lot of, we see some older people, but we see also quite a lot of younger people, perhaps in the uh, 20 to 30 age, 20 to 30 age bracket, also in the auditorium. And we, we, we know for a fact that it's not, it's not only, our, our platform does not appeal to only a, a restricted group of, a very restricted demographic. So, um, no, I don't. I think I think it cuts across, and in my fan base, in, in my um, my followership, there are a lot of young, quite a lot of young people, and the, the numbers are, are growing. So I don't think I don't think that is necessarily a restriction per se mm. or a, a problem. Anyways.
thank you so much Andrew Tando Adote so like I said I have followed you so I'm also going to urge other listeners to also follow your page uh, both on Instagram Twitter Facebook and anywhere available thank you so much for talking to us thank you so much God bless you God bless you too all right so the voice you just heard he was Andrew Tando Adote uh, he is a theater stage actor at Roverman Productions and obviously he is featured in other productions as well please uh, let's go and uh, follow him like he said in his post uh, Andrew underscore Tando underscore Adote that is what I see on Instagram so we can also check on other platforms Twitter and uh, Facebook to follow him there as well and again we find what he posted uh, sensible so we are sharing uh, yes we find it very sensible so we are sharing Marco yes, <laughs> let me come back to you um, has he satisfied you with his responses uh, because we were thinking about all these whether he's doing enough of the stage uh, to get more numbers yes yes um, we are satisfied I mean I know him mm -hmm. I know the part that is, he carries with us acting is concerned mm -hmm. but it's just unfortunate that he is not looked at mm -hmm. when it comes to project mm -hmm. so I don't know how he's going to do that but he need to show up because I don't think he attend auditions unless he's called Specifically to come, so he has to let people know him more, and then let, by doing let, that, let, let's get this point right. You think that when uh, any production house opens up uh, an opportunity for audition, he wouldn't go unless you invite him? Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. Well, so far as I know, because when I'm working on something, I always have to call him mm -hmm. to come because mm -hmm. I think it's always. But, but do you also put out the information to his reach to decipher whether he'll come or not? Yeah, because I know him, I normally bring him for appointments mm -hmm. to come and audition. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't want to bring him for an open for audition where mm -hmm. what I went was I know what he's capable of doing. Mm -hmm. So um, I think you should let people know him more, like people like Kofas, mm -hmm. Peter and all those people. They should know him more. Mm -hmm. Because if I'm working on a project, definitely I will recommend him for a role for the producer or the director to approve it. Mm -hmm. So I think you need to um, be more visible mm -hmm. to people. Mm -hmm. And then also like I know he knows KSM and all those people. Mm -hmm. Everybody who believes in him or every influential person who believes in him, mm -hmm. he should let them um, tag him, mm -hmm. um, like talk about him in mm -hmm. their post because that's one way that he can make it. And when Ibo White is posting something about Roverman, he should tag him because by so doing, people can also follow him. Mm -hmm. Else, he will be a great actor but will not have followers. It's a big problem. Most of our great actors here in Ghana mm -hmm. don't have a large following. Mm -hmm. Com like, yeah, Compared I mean, musicians. No, no, no. Like, like those who are, most of those who are not good have more following than those who are good. Oh, so okay. it's it's a big problem. Mm -hmm. I don't want to mention it, but if you check the balance, mm -hmm. I think also most of them buy the followers, like the sponsor, mm -hmm. so they get more people mm -hmm. because. If a company is coming to uh, maybe um, sign you as a brand, they always look at the number. They don't. Some people have like one million um, followers, but when they post and they get hundred, <laughs> hundred likes. So, but people don't check that. Yeah, I always check that. So, but a lot of people just get, oh, what's uh, how many followers do you have? But I think it's a big problem. So we should even if I, if I have hundred followers mm -hmm. and I post and I get ninety nine, I'm better than the person who has one million and get. Um, 10 likes. I see. So. But what do you need to go to Hollywood like he said? Is it the numbers? Or He's able to do. He got all the followers that he wants. So I think first is talent before any other thing. Alright, thank you so much. So, um, Adote or Andrew Tando Adote, uh, this is your message from uh, Moko Kwaji. He's saying that don't cry for the numbers. Boss, don't cry. Crying, baby. I uh, don't cry for the numbers. <laughs> Andrew Tando Adote posted sensible? Yeah, it's, uh, he spoke a lot of sense in uh -huh. that post and he mm -hmm. spoke in more sense in it, uh, over the phone. See, um, I think what he should really try to, to say that we are not paying attention to is I believe Ghanaians have gotten this culture where they tend to um, pay attention to things that do not necessarily matter. Mm -hmm. So, in order for you to get that attention, you need to be loud. Mm -hmm. you, need to be, you, you need to have a gimmick. You need to have some antics that put you in the news all the time. Mm -hmm. And it seems to be working for some people at the expense of those who are actually having the talent are, and are continuing 
to master that talent. Mm -hmm. Look, this thing he's talking about, it, it transcends beyond just actors. Okay, yeah. it mm -hmm. transcends beyond just actors. Mm -hmm. I was at um, the play Dora mm -hmm. and I've been at several Uruguay plays, and he's a fine actor. He's one of he's one of the finest that we have. Like mm -hmm. every character I've seen him mm -hmm. play on the Uruguay stage, mm -hmm. he's been able to deliver beyond any reasonable doubt. Mm -hmm. But he's not known. Look at the number of followers he has. Mm -hmm. You see, but and 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 like we've all agreed, there are certain people. Who have not yet been established themselves as, as actors, mm -hmm. but have all the, the following, and it's because of the antics they have, mm -hmm. some gimmick or some something that causes people to, to have them. their attention, and it's a culture. It's almost as if for you to become relevant to some extent, mm -hmm. you need to, to 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 do something. Even I sit in the my website is facing that same problem. I've lost out on sponsorship or uh, um, endorsements just because I don't have numbers as opposed to other websites that have more numbers. And what I, are you not doing right? That's why you're not having I'm the numbers. Just, I, I don't I don't do sensational stuff. I don't I don't post nude pictures mm -hmm. on my, my timeline. Mm -hmm. I don't talk about what this actor or actress is wearing. Mm -hmm. I get people hit me up with exclusives, gossips about other celebrities and I tell them I'm I'm not about that life. Mm -hmm. Okay, so and, and it's it's become more or less like that's what people want, want to see. Mm -hmm. I've had um, um, a lady, a Ghanaian lady, who is in um, the German, he hates me up and, and it's like, I've been following your reviews. You are doing something good for for the Ghanaian film industry. But when I check your 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 hits. Your, 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 your Instagram, mm -hmm. you don't have that ma many followers. Mm -hmm. How come? Mm -hmm. And I was like, um, maybe people don't people don't know what I do. And it's true, there are people, there are actors and actresses in this industry who yeah. have not even heard of ghmunifu.com. Mm -hmm. But this is the only website that speaks positive about the movie industry. The, the movie industry and the craft that people do. Mm -hmm. It is almost as if the Ghanaian audience of people have that culture of supporting things that don't necessarily matter. Mm -hmm. Look, a lot of the people who go to Andrew's place, mm -hmm. who see how talented he is, would see his picture and pass by it mm -hmm. online. They would see it randomly on their timeline they and they will not, they will not even like. <laughs> but they would see someone else's picture <laughs> for whatever reason or for whatever they are posing mm -hmm. in, in that picture, mm -hmm. be it male or female, mm -hmm. they would like and tag three extra friends to come and look mm -hmm. at the picture. Mm -hmm. You see, it's a culture that yeah. mm -hmm. it would take time for us to mm -hmm. and, and So and, you mean on social media, it needs to be a little dirty? Or, I, I, I'm, I'm beginning or to that is the online culture. I think <clears throat> that's 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 mm -hmm. the way it is. But for some of us, we can't seem to, to do that. Me mm -hmm. myself, I, I sometimes I wish I could do that, but I don't know. My my my, yeah, my persona it's, doesn't it's, like it's, agree with those kind of kind of things. Mm -hmm. And and I'm sure there are several artists like uh, and who are facing that problem. Mm -hmm. They could they could pay some blogger to do a scandal or something for them, and they would hate. The next morning they'll be trending. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. he, he could do that. But maybe he's not that person and he's staying true to what he believes in perfecting the shot. Every single player I've been to that I've seen this guy. Mm -hmm. He's 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 playing a different character mm -hmm. character. Mm -hmm. He he improves upon himself every time. But you don't know. And there are several look at the guys like Kogna Sam. Mm -hmm. Look at uh, mm -hmm. Joseph Potterman, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Henry Ado. Mm -hmm. Henry Ad Ad Adolfo. Yeah. Yeah. These people are very talented. That when you watch them, you know they are actually acting. Yeah. But they have to go and find some, I don't know, scandal or something to help grow their numbers. I'm, I'm seeing this okay. category. I've lost out on deals just because I don't have numbers. And I saw these deals go to other websites <laughs> because... Who are not doing anything incredible. Exactly. And I, I, I sit back and I'm like... And, and someone will, will be like... Mm -hmm. But we, we are putting in the work and they expect you to go, but they won't they won't like comment share on okay. your, your post. So what he's saying is it goes more I think he's doing everything he's supposed to do. It All goes right. to the audience and the rest of the world. If you like someone, mm -hmm. support them. Alright. Yeah. Tony Asankoma, I would I would advise you to eat. <laughs> eat. Think about it. As a journalist, you must eat. However, <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, as a journalist, you must eat. So you should do what others are doing to eat. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
All right, so your talent and your numbers, which one do you need to go to Hollywood? Numbers are very important, mm -hmm. but talent is paramount. Mm -hmm. Why am I saying this? Um, if you want to compare what is happening in Hollywood, like Ophia Samara rightly said, so that in Hollywood they, they consider numbers a lot. Mm -hmm. But the point, you, you, the question you need to ask is on what basis do they consider the numbers? Mm -hmm. Do they consider the numbers just for the sake of numbers? Or they consider the numbers because the people who have the numbers are noted for something? which is very positive mm -hmm. as compared to what we see over here. Mm -hmm. You talk about um, Arnold Schwarzenegger, mm -hmm. Jet Li and all those people, fine. Mm -hmm. They keep doing the same thing that we know them to be doing, but that is action. Mm -hmm. they are, um, their journey of film is action. Mm -hmm. And action, you, you, are, you are the hero, mm -hmm. you don't fight the same way all the time. Mm -hmm. you, you get it? So when it comes to action, it is different. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to drama, and you want to be what we call stereotype, you want to be noted for the same thing all the time. A bedroom baby, you know, and, and that is a danger over there. Mm -hmm. So, now, to what Marco was saying, mm -hmm. you see, we, we have come to a point where, fine, the numbers are there, you can follow them, but these people need training. For example, Moesha Budon, mm -hmm. um, for real, raise that issue. I don't have any problem with somebody who wants to live their life in a certain way. Mm -hmm. you, you, you get it. But then, is the person on screen, is the person acting well? That is another question to ask. Because the person might have all the numbers. Mm -hmm. The person, you, 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 you go after the person because of the numbers. Mm -hmm. The person is put on screen and the person is not able to deliver. Mm -hmm. And when the viewers come, they will see, oh, mm -hmm. and we have we have seen movies where, yes, you, you, you follow a particular um, 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 personality, you want to see the movie, and then you go there, and the person sees you are disappointed. Yeah. Exactly. It is it's a very serious issue. Mm -hmm. we, sh we need to be careful of the kind of culture that we are breeding. Mm -hmm. There is coming a time where people with numbers who don't know Jack will override and overshadow those who can really do the job but do not have the numbers. We stand for for, for various things, mm -hmm. okay? Now, let's use um, cars. Mm -hmm. uh, um, Bentley, mm -hmm. Rolls Royce, mm -hmm. do they have numbers? Mm -hmm. No, they have quality. Mm -hmm. They are very expensive. You know the cars with numbers. Mm -hmm. when, you are, when you see them all over the place, the are mm -hmm. So, uh -huh. So these are the things we well, need to look at. If, 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 as filmmakers, you always chase the numbers, then we stand a, a, a great chance of destroying our industry. Mm -hmm. My last example, Leonardo DiCaprio, mm -hmm. before he featured in, uh, played a lead mm -hmm. in um, Titanic, mm -hmm. did he have the numbers? No. He got the numbers, he got the dates after, after, after that. So we need to think and think carefully. Well, let's say it, let's say it. By your car example, though. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Okay, I'll not mention any time. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, for real. W when you were going to Hollywood, didn't no, have numbers. Let's, let's think. Let's, uh, well, let's think. Uh -huh. Let's uh, make when I'm speaking. Let me land with my point no, before no, you no, shut no, it down. No, 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 no. I'll not no. let you land. You let point. me land with my point. Uh, listen, radio. People, going. people listen to radio with time. So yes. if, no, you so it wait, 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 if you cut it off, if you cut it off, and we don't, I don't For real, for real, calm down. If you don't calm down, you still not make any point. Uh, people listen to radio with time. So yes. when you are making a point, make it in a way that should someone end listening, the person will go with a good vibe. Because the way you started it, like, uh, she is a slave queen, so if she doesn't, uh, you know, that thing. That, that was the understanding. And I needed to. No. You know, I've never when, when we also I've never got into where I was. I, I, I listen to other programs, and sometimes some panel members speak the same way about me or any other person. I feel that, ah, what was the presenter sitting there doing? Was he not listening? So I needed to do it, so we always walk the right path. Uh -huh. So if I did not get you well, I'm still giving you a minute to get that point clear. No, that's we're, we're done with. I'm not going to speak on that. You're anymore. not going to that? Uh, okay, yeah. okay, 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 okay. No problem. So now let's talk about the numbers and the talent. And like I'm saying, when you went to Hollywood, no, they didn't know you there like that in terms of numbers. No, in terms of numbers, first of all, mm -hmm. um, when we're talking um, about talent, yes. the casting agency themselves, mm -hmm. why, why the essence of the casting agency? First of all, they want someone who has the talent that suits a particular 
um, brand, brand or audience. Mm -hmm. So they um, send whatever messages to the casting agency mm -hmm. and they fish out whoever it is to the talent before numbers. Mm -hmm. So the talent first of all comes before the talent before the numbers before the numbers mm -hmm. you understand sometimes sometimes you might even you might even have the numbers mm -hmm. at the end of the day mm -hmm. you have no relevance they might give you the whole role mm -hmm. director waste mm -hmm. time mm -hmm. and every other thing mm -hmm. on you mm -hmm. but at the end of the day mm -hmm. you, you come up with nothing mm -hmm. but if you have the numbers too mm -hmm. and you have the talent mm -hmm. that's a that's a proper balance okay. So yeah. you need both. You need both the you, numbers. You need both the, the numbers, but first in line is the talent. Thank you so much for real means uh, for wrapping up this discussion. Put out by Andrew Tando Adote, uh, theater stage actor, Roverman Productions. He is saying that guys follow them, support them, and let them win because with your support they can now go to Hollywood with.